So here we are at McGee Creek. We have just arrived and got the tent pitched up over here. And got camp set up. Tomorrow we're hiking up in there. We got some beautiful snow up here on the mountains. Nice crisp air. Everything's going well. Well, this is our first night at Hume Lake. We're grilling marshmallows here. I mean, <laughs> Hume Lake. Whoa. Okay, McGee Creek. Yeah, wrong place. All right. So we we have a tip for you. If cre your cream soda gets a little frothy, just stick like a boiling hot skewer into it. Well, yeah, yeah, kind of like that. Like it looks blue, but it's red hot. So yeah. <laughs> <laughs> kind of like that. Stick that into your cream soda and it just goes boosh, and, and the froth is gone. Alakajam. Yeah. Like you can't see our face. Well, this is the first morning at Mickey Creek. We are Not hiking young. today. Um, last night we had kind of a unusual visitor. Last year we found a rattlesnake and that was really unusual. Now this year there was a bear that was just dragged out our cooler right from under the RV and was just digging through it, ate two pounds of bacon and two crates of milk. So anyway, and that's only on the first night. <laughs> so I don't know what's up. Snow covered mountains back there. Now check this out. Look at that redwood tree. That is thick tree. So this is what it looks like walking down into the in, onto the creek. It just pulls right down, all the way down through there. Well, these might be mountain lions or bear tracks, and you can see by my hand right there, they are pretty big, and they're just side by side all the way up here. They're pretty big, so we don't really know what it is. You can see down in there there's tracks and it starts to bound on the bottom there. I think it might be a mountain lion. There's two arm marks or it might have pounced on something underneath the snow right in there in the center of the frame. So here we are, we're at the pond. Here's the lower pool. There's the dam. And there's the lake, right there. Well, there you go, Papa. That's a nice native trout for you on your spinner. Right there. On this beautiful lake.
Well, we're coming down from the end of the hiking up to the lake. We're, I would say, a little under halfway down. Back all the way down there and past the mountain. So anyway, yep. We got nice juicy steaks waiting for us at home. <laughs> and a comfy chair. It's the last look at that, that mountain. Well, this is June Lake. See the shallows down there, and there's a and the beautiful color of the water. It's pretty big. Well, this is Gold Lake. This is the second lake in the June Lake Sloop. Boat right there just pulled in a bunch of trout. The float tubing going on. Another beautiful lake. Some nice lodges and resorts up there it looks like. Right there. Ah, beautiful lake. Some nice meadow over there. It's been half drained for some reason. There's still some water and a nice looking cove over here. So we're gonna try this. Here's the stream. This is the afternoon of our last full day at McGee Creek. It's after dinner and me and Sean are shooting up a target here. Take a look at that wall. Oh man, and we're shooting at this bottle here. I just took the cap off right now. Anyway, so we just got finished with dinner. It's our last day. Well, this is the conclusion to our four day fishing trip up in the Sears at McGee Creek. Eight nice trout here. I caught another one this morning on the stream. And some trout we are we also already ate, so we caught more than just this. And this is just what me and Dad caught. Okay, that is a dinner fit for a king. Two trout fried in bacon fat with um carrots and some potatoes. I mean, yeah. Well, we're leaving McGee Creek now. All right, time is up. It's just too short when we're here. We need to go for longer. Hopefully we'll come back up this summer. Well, we're leaving now. Bye.